Jeremy Clarkson's Amazon Prime video series, named Clarkson's Farm, was a huge success with viewers when it landed on screens in 2021. The series follows the former Top Gear host working on his 1,000-acre farm in the Cotswolds with the help of locals. The 62-year-old earned just £144 in profit last year, so has purchased cows, more chickens and his own restaurant in a bid to bring in more business. When asked what viewers can do if they want to help farmers, Jeremy said, I'd try to buy stuff with a red tractor on it, because that means it was grown and produced here to a good standard. You can go and buy Australian beef which, I'm sure, stops you from dying of hunger. But you're not really supporting the British beef industry if you do that. He added, I mean, avocados. Everyone should stop buying those, they're so terrible for the environment. Happy Valley fans work out reason poppies always in the coat and don't buy palm oil, which comes from Borneo and is killing orangutans, when you could buy vegetable oil made with oil sea drape. He advised people to ask themselves where their food comes from when they do their shopping. Did this come from down the road? Jeremy asked. In which case, the food miles are less plus the chances are it was grown to a pretty high standard because the standards in this country are very good and you're supporting British farming people like, dairy farmer, Emma who have no wage at all. He revealed local farmer Emma told him if it was not for Diddley Squat Farm Shop, she would have gone under ages ago. This is because so many people are buying her milkshakes, which are delicious, and her milk, which is so nice, Jeremy stressed. If you taste her milk, and then go to a supermarket and buy their milk, it's like two completely separate products. While Emma has personally thanked Jeremy for running a farm, he admitted the rest of the village is divided over his presence. He said, in a way, the village is divided. It's difficult to say how many people support us in the village and how many don't. Dot Jeremy Clarkson swipes at Brian May as he opens up on farm heartache, update Jeremy Clarkson shouted at by girlfriend as he takes time off, latest James May slams Jeremy Clarkson's creepy Meghan Markle comments, insight, some of it, I'm sure, comes from my past, and driving quickly around corners while shouting, and they didn't find that appealing. He continued, as far as the farm is concerned. It's split pretty neatly between those who have a house number, you know, 22 Oak Avenue or 3 Grove or whatever, who tend to support us because we bring business to the area and jobs for their kids. Some of them are more than happy to go have a nice pint with a lovely view just up the road. So that works. All the regular characters are returning for the second series of Clarkson's Farm such as farming contractor Caleb Cooper. In the opening episode of the new series, the harvest season is about to hit, but that is not the biggest challenge Jeremy faces. Following the fallout from Brexit, farmers like Jeremy face uncertain futures and have little or no guidance from the government about where to focus their efforts. Clarkson's Farm returns to Amazon Prime Video on February 10, 